I went for a mammogram and they found a lump in my left breast. And um, I had surgery in May. They took out lymph nodes. They took out, I think they were, it was eight. And um, my arm started swelling. So when I was in chemo, um, I, I told the doctor that my arm was swelling. She said, well, maybe we can do, you know, uh, occupational therapy. There you go, how's that? We are a part of the fabulous team here at Shores with all sorts of oncology rehab. We do breast primarily, we do some head and neck, and we also see patients with pelvic or gynecological cancers. Mostly Carrie gives me the massage. <laughs> feels so good, but sometimes it hurts, but um, it helps a lot. So to start, we usually will do like a passive range of motion check-in and a neural, te neural tension test to see how tight they are in that upper extremity. And that helps too when we're done to say, you know, you've gained this much range and a lot less neural tension. So we go through trigger point release to different muscle bellies in the upper extremity, upper back, stomach, and then we do lymphatic massage to help activate the lymphatic system, get lymph fluid moving so that it's not accumulating in those tissues and causing discomfort. All right, so we were at 150, we're at 156. Go get your breast scanned, <laughs> you know, do your mammogram. Um, it had been a long time since I had one, um, but the earlier they can catch it, the better you are. Well, of course, mammograms. <laughs> if you're over 40, you should be getting your annual mammogram. And if you are a breast cancer survivor and you notice um, heaviness, achiness, fatigue, numbness, or tingling in your surgery arm or upper back chest area, that's a sign that your lymphatic system might be having some problems. And if you feel a lot of tightness when you're reaching, you have difficulty doing some of those things that you used to be able to do, we might be able to help with that.